Oh my gosh, is this for real? Really? I'm gonna wear the lash? I was waiting for you. I just beat the Nimbasa City Simulator. Oh my god, is it for real? We are battling ourselves. Oh shit. That intro, guys, I can't speak anything more. Hello Ash Buddies, welcome back to another new episode of Pokemon Moon Black 2. So let's start the episode right now. It's been a week or so since I did another Pokemon Moon Black 2 episode. So there you have it. This is episode number 12. At least in this episode I'm planning on reaching another town other than Castilia City. So like the video and wait for that so let's continue our game i'm in the castilla city right now and by my recent research i have found a thing so not a thing though uh, more than a thing so those are uh, two things that i'm gonna show you right now so before further ado let's check our team so this is hakai our starter pokemon and evolve this is uh, Corina and this is Scar, the leader of the team and last but not the least this is Buddy and uh, Quill where is he? there is he, Quill it's uh, my favorite Pokemon though Shiny Cyndaquil Shiny you know one Cyndaquil more specifically so the thing, the thing I'm gonna show you is uh, just a few steps away so I think this is it, this is it, the passerby communications I think, no not here, so it's not the place, so the place is actually this one, the battle company, so if you go there and have a few steps ahead, yeah, people who work in the building have Pokemon battles, not opinion battles, this is the chairman, you appear to be strong, but if you go upstairs, please be extra careful. Oh yes, if you'd like, you showed your Pokemon hold this. Okay, okay, that was the first thing. That's an EXP share. A Pokemon holding an EXP share gets some of the XP points from every battle, even it's not involved. So we already have one. I got an EXP share from somewhere else. So I don't remember it exactly. So Having another one would be definitely helpful as we are training two low leveled pokemons right here in our team Buddy and Quill. So giving two XP shares for them would definitely make the cut. So I'm searching where is it in the key items. No it isn't in the key items. Okay there it is. There it is. That's the EXP share. So yeah I'm gonna give one to Buddy and one to Quill. So they both would gain XP points from each battle so it would be easy for them to level up yep so Will got one and Buddy got another EXP share so we have two EXP shares in this game I don't wanna go battle upstairs so no no I'm fine right now so yeah let's get out of this building and do the second thing so the second thing is right from this Pokemon Center's uh, left side I think, no it's right. I'm so done with this directions guys because I don't exactly know which side. So I'm gonna show you while I'm playing this. So I think this is the way, yes from this Harley Quinn if you go that way, there it is the art museum but before that I think we can buy Castilia cones again yes I'm gonna buy 12 of them thank you actually Castilia cones help us to heal our status conditions so that's a great thing so there you go that's the Pokemon I've been waiting for you to show so it's a Chikorita you know one form and as it is it's a shiny one so yep we got an uh, you know one Chikorita so actually this one is actually my favorite among all the three others 
even totodile is not that favorite for me because this is an ice type what would be any pokemon if it's an ice type i like it if it's a steel type i like it if it's a fire type i like it so it's a nice type so i obviously i like it so that's my favorite among other others you can see quill is a fire and steel two of the majority typings that i like so that's the reason i kept it in my team so that's it i can't speak anything more than that so yeah there's a cherish ball out there catching that stupid i mean catching that stupid i said stupid because it was it took me so long to find that so finally i found it chikorita it uses telepathy to read human thoughts in battle chikorita waves it leaves around to keep the foe at bay so that's it another i think that's a difficult i mean different pokedex entry though so i'm gonna name it hella because hella is actually uh, the god of destruction from thor ragnarok so i actually kept uh, Cyndaquil as Quill who is a Peter Quill from Guardians of the Galaxy so I think I like Marvel more <laughs> so I have one nickname my pokemon mostly Marvel just like Scar the Lion King so it's it's Disney though so Hawkeye is actually Marvel yeah that's great Hawkeye is actually Marvel and Quill is actually Marvel and Hela is going to be a Marvel team too I don't know if I would ever use that Chikorita in my team because I already have pretty great Pokemon with me though. So if I ever want to switch out Buddy, so I'll switch with Chikorita. <laughs> so because Buddy is actually a Pikachu though, if it's actually anime, I would have kept it. But it's not anime though, it's game. So I just want to make sure that my team has powerful Pokemon. Of course, if I evolve it using a Thunderstone, that Raichu would be great too. But I already used it in my Hoenn region walkthrough, so I don't want another Raichu in my team though. As it's especially a roam hack, we can get diversity of Pokemon. So I want to catch more of them, which I haven't catched before. But uh, Lucario is another game, though I don't want to speak more about that. Lucario is totally another game because even though I caught it in many games, what? Having lots of battles is the best way to grow quickly. Okay, okay. Even though I caught it at in other games like my super glazed version and um, in another game which I don't remember right now. So even though I did that, Lucario is actually something like uh, my third favorite Pokemon, Scizor, Greninja and Lucario. So yeah, I can't miss that. If you can't actually get Scizor in the in the games I'm playing because it actually needs a trade evolution, so that's impossible to use that in my team. And another impossible thing is getting Ash Greninja in any games. So I I heard I heard that you can get actually Ash Greninja in this game. So I guess I'll wait for that. But in any other game, you actually can't get it except for if it's xy and if it's a lola i mean sun and moon or ultra sun and moon so that too they are actually event pokemon so we can't get it more so the third favorite pokemon of mine is lucario which is of course usable in most of the games like uh, the games released after sino region and even in uh, art gold and soul silver I think I can bring a Rialu, so yeah, I can use that in there too, and in any Pokemon game that has been released after Sinnoh regions, so yeah, that's why I like Lucario to use in my team, so that's my sort of thing. So finally, that EXP shell literally just worked out, so I'm gonna get an evolution right now. So that's a um, you know what uh, Cyndaquil evolving into you know what uh, Quillava. Wow, that's amazing. That's that's amazing, guys. Look at that. <laughs> Let's look at that. I'm just making these sprites myself. 
You know, getting these prides in the net is the big, is the worst thing ever happened to me because I never thought those would be unavailable in the internet though. So I had to make them myself. I made them myself actually. So I made Unova Cinequil and Unova Quilava myself too. So and another one is uh, Unova Chikorita and Bayleaf and its evolution uh, Meganium are actually available in the internet though so they were only the ones which are available i literally did not see totodile so where the heck are you man rest in peace totodile though so we are having a discussion right there so i don't want to mess with that so let's say yes thank you so much okay tell me what kind of person you are what would you be favorite phrase that you used to greet you So we are going to select a phrase that I would use for greeting everyone. I actually use hello, but right now I can't type that many letters, so I'm going to go with hi. That's a great line. Then what would you say? You want anyone will understand, you know, so I didn't read that. So I guess we are going to say what do you say when impressed? So if I am impressed, I of course say wow. That's it. I can't I just say wow. That is I'm surprised I'm impressed. Hi wow, I knew it. You are the one. Who else could be well suited? So that's it guys. I think he's going to give that to managers. So let's just do that. So I'm going to not I'm not going to do any additional things though because I don't want to waste my time on this stupid thing. This is actually a side quest. So I'm not interested in that much. So how should we address you? Okay. What's your title? This is only your nickname in the avenue. So I'm gonna go with Gary though because I already my original name is Ash. So I can't nickname myself Ash. So Gary would be a great thing because he's actually into this stuff more than Ash though because Gary likes publicity. Gary likes other things. Gary, Gary, he's the best. So. I'm going to nickname myself as Gary until in this avenue and just get out of here because I don't want to call myself as Gary. So, development of the avenue, so many people will visit. I'll explain how to develop when you are ready. So, I'm not ready right. I'm not ready. Literally, I'm not ready. So, let's just get out of this place and I don't want to complete this side quest more and more because that's not a thing. So, he's actually waiting for a new store in the avenue. So welcome Nimbasa city at least I saw another city other than the Nighty Castelia city though So yes let's get into the Pokemon center and mark our visit by just healing our pokemon by using Nurse Joy's great healing technique So okay I'll take your pokemon for a few seconds thanks a lot Nurse Joy We have restored your pokemon to full health we have to see again thank you So he's going to give us a medal. So after taking the medal, I want to challenge the gym leader because I didn't think I mean I don't think I did a lot of time taking in this reaching the Nimbasa city. Of course we can take the long way or the desert resort way, but still this is the easiest one. So let's challenge the Nimbasa city gym leader, but before that this is it guys. This is it. This is the thing I'm going to do right now. Trino was waiting for you at the left of Nimbasa's exit. He's not going to bail so long after you're done with the you can help me. Okay. So actually in the original Moon Bla- I mean in the original Black 2 game, you actually get to battle alongside Rosa, who is actually the other character in the game. But in this game, she's telling us to meet a person in the left exit of the Nimbasa city. So I think this is the place it is. No, no, no. She said literally she said left exit. What am I doing, guys? What am I doing? So it's actually the left exit. All the exits to this side are actually right. So this side is actually my left. So oh my gosh. Literally is it for real? Oh my god. I'm not I just can't take this anymore, guys. Oh shit. I'm going to battle Ash. God, I can't take this anymore. So, I'm going to check once more if it's a glitch or just No, it isn't a glitch. We are going to battle actually ourselves. So, we are going to battle ourselves. Really? 
Really am I doing this? Oh shit. Let's battle Ash. Let's battle Ash and beat him so badly. I was waiting for you. I just beat the Nimbasa City gym leader. Oh my god. He's so strong. I want to see how strong you really are. I know you're a strong man. Oh my gosh. This intro is just so sick. I can't just take this guys. I don't have any more words. He's gonna battle us and the first Pokemon that's gonna come out is a Pikachu and our starter is gonna go battle him too and Pikachu is actually level 32 so comparing with our buddy he's so higher level so Volt Tackle that just barely hit him so Hakai is not gonna do one hit too he's gonna save the HP too so I'm gonna go for a Scar or a no, Scar would be the best choice though, so I'm gonna go with Scar. Yes! He used Full Restore. Now, now I know why I use more healing items like Full Restore, Revive, etc. in the battle. If I'm about to lose, I just do the magic by using healing items. So, <laughs> I guess that came from Ash though. So, yeah, let's start. Let's start, guys. One down there. And we still have oh my god buddy is learning a little ball so who do you want the tail whip though why do you want the tail whip i just don't want that so electro ball is just an awesome move and quill is gaining a level two so he's gonna send a tora cat which is of course weak to my rocking type i mean rock type rocking type and that intimidate is so oh my god look at that sprite though guys that's so sick Look at that sprite, oh my god, I just like that. It just flinched though, so I guess this bite can take that down. So I like Torakat much, the sprite wise. And Hakai sprite is also a great one though. So Buddy and Quill both gained a level. And the next one is a Lycan Rock, Dusk form. So I wanna see a battle between Dusk Lycan Rock and Dusk Lycan Rock, but this isn't the time for that because I'm actually lower level than him so I can't take risk right now because it's already 30 though so my Pokemon is a bit higher level but still it already knows Stone Age and it has Rock Gem no guys I can't just make that happen so yeah this is gonna take down that another force pump so Stone Age is really powerful move guys really powerful move I just hope I had that on my Lycan Rock though. Why don't I have it? I have like a Stealth Rock but I don't have Stone Edge though. So Buddy grew to level 20 and Quill also gained a level and he's learning Flame Wheel. So I guess I'm gonna remove that stupid move. So finally I removed that and I got Flame Wheel and it gained another level. Oh my gosh, we literally got 30,000 for winning. That's the power. You're really strong. I have been waiting for a trainer to give this item to. He's gonna give us an item? What would be that? I really wonder. This battle was the best. So he's gonna give us a Charizard item. Why? We literally don't have a Charmander with us. So I can we evolve that okay we have mega evolution in this game and we have one super mega evolving pokemon this is a mega stone they can be found throughout the unova region so we have lucario that can mega evolve you can use them to evolve let's go pikachu we have to become a lot stronger that's the awesome phrase though yeah finally we have the charizard white so I wonder why I always get Charizard right why in the GIA we have Mega Evolution and I received Charizard right why I still feel bad for that I always wanted Charizard X so Mega Charizard Y is a good one though because it 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 got me win the Pokemon League in the GIA version so never mind guys I don't want to do anything more in this game because I'm already satisfied by battling Ash Ketchum myself so he gave a hint that we are gonna have Mega Evolution and of course Corina is the best for that and we have Quill evolved in this episode so look at that sprite though guys this is awesome so I'm gonna save the game right here right today so 
this team this team literally battled ash ketchum and we actually won the battle so i'm so happy and proud of that so and we are pokemon trainer ash and the brave one so that's it guys um i'm so happy for that battle though we finally saw 100 pokemon in the national wide so if you want more pokemon moon black to content make sure you like the video and get it as many likes as possible and subscribe to the channel if you are new to it share it to all the pokemon buddies so meet you in the next one this is ash signing off